CMPC is one of the leading forestry companies in Latin America. With a presence in more than 50 countries on five continents, with over 25 factories, it has approximately 17,000 employees, operating mainly in the areas of forestry, cellulose, and paper products. The company has a diversified export trading network, reaching over 200 customers in 30 countries. The pulp is shipped from its private and covered port. At this port, about 4,000 tons of pulp is loaded daily and sent to the public port of Rio Grande. But for their process to be perfect and their production time to be shorter, CMPC decided to replace their cranes with Kane cranes playing a significant role for Saj. First, a dedicated team was gathered to coordinate the implementation of the engineering project and to create a comprehensive safety project with daily safety meetings, covering any assembly and cargo movement, from scaffolding and building safe paths to dismantling the old cranes and the assembly of the new Kone Cranes ones. Personnel and site safety was always a priority. It has always been and it will always be one of Kone Cranes' cornerstones. Together, occupational safety technicians from CMPC and Kone Cranes employed techniques and means to ensure all work was done with the best strategy and highest level of safety. After the arrival of all equipment, the mechanical and electrical assemblies, electrical and hydraulic connections, lubrication, preparations were made so the equipment would be ready for commissioning. The components were brought from Finland, reaching the port of Santos in São Paulo State, Brazil. From there, they were taken to Kone Cranes headquarters in Cochia, interior of São Paulo, where all the cranes were built and assembled, then headed to Goiba in Rio Grande do Sul State, where CMPC is located. The challenges for all partner companies was to avoid factory production interruption. Thus, barge loading was done with alternate means. While the north wing was disassembled, the shipment was made by the south wing. In the placement of the beams, every detail was carefully planned so that every action was successful, as all cargo movements required a lot of attention and safety. It was quite a difficult challenge, requiring a lot of technology and a well-planned strategy to work in a conflict-filled area, demanding high safety and air-free operations, all without interfering with the ongoing work. Everything had to be carefully designed and executed to achieve excellence. Music 